Hi, and welcome to ThruText, a peer-to-peer -peer texting platform that lets you have real conversations real fast. When you send messages with ThruText, your messages come from a real cell phone number and a real person, allowing you to engage with your audience one-to-one -one at scale. We've worked with thousands of clients who have used ThruText to send over 1 billion text messages for getting out the vote, volunteer recruitment, fundraising, surveys, event recruitment, and more. Our clients include political campaigns, advocacy organizations, nonprofits, unions, colleges, universities, and independent schools. To get started, we'll watch a quick one-minute explainer video of how it works and then jump into the details. Your organization has an important message to share, but sometimes it can feel like your outreach just gets sucked into a black hole. Emails get ignored, social media posts get buried, and direct mail gets tossed in the recycling bin. But there's one type of outreach that still gets through, text messages. With through text, you can have thousands of personalized one-to-one -one conversations with your audience. It's fast, easy, and makes your message impossible to ignore. Here's how it works. First, upload your list of phone numbers. We'll scrub out the landlines. Next, write your message template. Then, send out your messages from your computer or mobile device and wait for the responses to flow in. Conversations will be trackable and centralized, and your engagement rates will be out of this world. You can use through text to recruit for an event, ask for a donation, remind people to vote, or just about anything else. Escape the communications black hole with the best-in-class leader in text messaging and get started with through text today. In the rest of this demo, you'll learn about ThruText's core functionality, how to upload a group of people you want to text, how to create a campaign, how to send out messages, and how to manage your campaign results. Let's start with groups. To upload a group, all you need is a spreadsheet with the first name, last name, and phone number of the list of people you'd like to text. We'll validate whether or not the numbers you've uploaded are textable. You can also include custom merge fields to personalize your message. Today I'm using email, but you can use as many custom fields as you'd like in your groups. You'll download your group as a CSV file and navigate back to ThruText. From the Groups tab, click the New Group button. Give the group a name, then drag and drop or upload your CSV. Now we're going to make sure our fields are mapped correctly. First name, last name, and phone auto map, and so will the custom fields if you've added them. You'll review and then create your group. At this point, we'll validate if those numbers that you've uploaded are textable, and once that's complete, you can export all of your validation data for your records. With the group of people we want to text uploaded, we can move on to the next step, creating our campaign. From the Campaigns tab, we'll hit the New Campaign button. Start by giving your campaign a name, a description, and some settings. We'll then choose the area codes we want our messages to come from, so they look familiar to the group of people we're texting. Next, we'll add the group we uploaded earlier as the target list on this campaign. It's important to note that ThruText has great advanced targeting features, like adding or removing people from past groups you've uploaded or past campaigns you've run. For today, we're going to target just our sample group. On the second step of campaign creation, we'll add message senders, or the people who we'd like to send your messages. Message senders might be staff, volunteers, or yourself. From here, we'll craft our initial message, meaning the first text that your message senders will send to everyone on your target list. You'll see that we can use merge fields like your recipient's first and last name, your message sender's first and last name, and any custom fields you've uploaded. Let's pretend I'm working for an organization recruiting volunteers to help out at an upcoming event. We could say something like, Hi First Name, this is Sender First Name from Acme. We've got an event happening this Saturday at 2 p.m. in Oakland. Are you able to come volunteer?
And we can also preview what that message is going to look like below. You can also create recommended replies for the message sender sending out texts on your behalf. Recommended replies are like canned responses your message senders can use to respond to common questions that come up. It's important to note that your senders can tweak and customize these replies within their individual conversations to make responses feel more natural and authentic. I'll set up recommended replies in this example to help message senders respond to people who say they will be available to help volunteer. On the fifth step, you'll set up survey questions. Surveys are a mechanism for your message senders to collect data on the conversations they're having, and they are not visible to the recipients on your target list. You can collect multiple choice, multiple answer, yes, no, or free form survey questions. In this scenario, I'll set up a survey question to collect whether or not the group of people I'm texting are able to come help volunteer at my event, and a free form survey in case I want to take any notes on the conversation. All of your survey response data can be exported at the end of a campaign. The last step is to review and make sure everything looks good. Let's go ahead and launch our campaign. Now that our campaign is live, we can get started sending out messages in the Messenger tab. Message senders in your account will only interact with the page we see right now, where they will be able to view their new and active assignments. When we click into our assignment, it takes us into the Messenger console. On the left, we'll see the list of people we need to text. At the bottom, we can see the initial message that we'll need to send out to everyone in our assignment. And on the right, we'll see the description we gave the campaign. This is also where our recommended replies and survey questions will show up, but not until we send out all of our initial messages. To send out your initial messages, you'll press send for each individual recipient on your target list. You can send approximately 200 messages per minute in through text. And once you send out all of your initial messages, you'll see the replies show up from the recipients who text you back. With each response, you'll want to start by collecting data if applicable and then replying using a custom response or by using recommended replies, tweaked as needed. If anyone ever asks to opt out of a texting campaign, it is both easy and critically important to complete the opt out when requested. Click the opt out button and confirm that you'd like to send them a final text letting them know you've completed the opt out and hit Submit. That will send the recipient the last text letting them know that you have completed the opt-out and remove them from the campaign. That individual will no longer show up in the message sender's assignment and they will be opted out of all campaigns in your ThruText account. And that's it! Let's head back to the administrator side of ThruText and take a look at some campaign management features. Now that we're back inside our active campaign, we can see some high-level analytics around the campaign activity. You also have the ability to QA your message sender's conversations in the Conversations tab. When you click on the name of a message sender, you'll be able to see all the conversations assigned to that individual on the campaign. You can review their conversations, collect data or respond on their behalf, manage opt-outs, or reassign conversations between or away from senders if they are unable to complete their assignment. ThruText also offers easy campaign cloning, so you don't have to create campaigns from scratch each time you need to text. We have a variety of easy-to-access campaign and account-level exports as well. If you're working for a political campaign, ThruText has a great integration with Van that provides an easy two-way data sync. In this demo, we covered the basics of ThruText, how to upload a group of people you want to text, how to create a campaign, how to send messages, and how to manage your campaign results. To learn more about ThruText's robust features or to get started with an account, shoot us a note at sales at getthrough.io or sign up on our website, getthrough.io.